Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Blindly Play Resident Evil with me, Fu. And as you'll see, I am all decked out. I have the pistol, full ammo, shotgun, full ammo, the blue herb, for the poison, and I've got two batches of mixed herbs. I'm actually going to drop off the combat knife though, because I want to pick up a clip. I want to pick up the clip because we've got all our ammo consolidated into one. Because uh, we, I, I did go back and look up for look for shells, and I was able to find them. Um, it's just I ended up using them. <laughs> uh, there we go. Don't know why I want the <laughs> want the pistol in first, but eh, what are we gonna do? Just call me crazy. <laughs> but excuse me if I'm a little quieter than I usually am in these episodes. But I gotta be a little quieter because it's almost like eleven now. And people are probably going to sleep. Let's try to take on these spiders once again. Oof. I don't want to do it. I don't. I don't. I can't. No, I can't save. <laughs> I'd be cheating. I don't care. <laughs> uh, I, I really wish I had an ink ribbon right now. But it looks like this is the only way to go, so... By the way, I killed all the dogs on the way here, so we don't have to worry about them. Uh, but it took me like 40 minutes to get here. A half an hour, 40 minutes. I don't know, because I wasn't really playing... Actively playing, I was more... There we go! Die! One more shot. Yes! Oh, you're dead. What? Mini spiders? Mini spiders? Okay. Uh, get the pistol out. There are fucking mini spiders around. Oh my god, I can't... Die, you son of a bitch. Okay, I'm poisoned. We can fix that. Ha ha. Use the mixed herbs. I'm back to fine. Run over all those spiders. Because they are not growing up to be like those freaking grotesque... Like, what are the... What was the... What's what's the horror story with, like, the giant... The island of giant beasts? Isn't that like Dr. Moreau or something? I hate you creepy crawlies. Ugh. Get on him. Run over him. The other thing I'm afraid is if I leave any of them living and I come back here later, there's going to be more spiders. Okay. So we got the spiders. Cool. Oh, I did not die that time. That is the best news ever. Is that something on the table I can pick up? No, it looks like it's just like a bit of spider that went flying. Oh, wait, wait, wait. <gasps> oh! Hey, Grimmed! Oh my god! Don't tell me there, there, there better not be another one on the ceiling over here. Get over here! Crush you! Crush you into the ground! No, it doesn't look like it. I hope not, at least. <sighs> okay, no, 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 good. Oh, uh, no, get back here. Get back here. Like, that's what I'm afraid is going to happen. Like, if I leave them, that there's going to be more of those monsters. I don't use the term monster lightly, let me tell you. <laughs> I hate spiders. I was telling Oix Girlfu because I was I actually called her while I was making my way back here. Um, it's broken. Oh, it is a pinball machine. Yeah, let's play some pinball. Um, is that something wedged between it and the wall? Um, like I was saying, I was talking to Oix Girlfu while I was making my way back back here. something underneath 
No, I guess not. It looked like there was something underneath the the pool table. But I was tell <laughs> let me finish the story for once. I was telling Oix Girlfu as I was making my way back here that I just I don't a nine ball. I don't like spiders. Um, it's not that I have a huge problem with spiders. I really like spiders. Um, I think they're fascinating and, of course, they're great animals because of the pests they take care of. Um, but I can't handle, like, small, creepy, crawly things, like the kind of things that can crawl on you. <laughs> small things that can crawl on you. That's the definition of what I don't like. Like, I've had, re I've had nightmares of, like stuff about about stuff like that all right looks like we got all of them so wait is that another clip on that barrel no okay well, looks like we got all of them so and it looks like there's nothing else in this room except for something to do with that eight ball, that nine ball or something uh so let's go but that's really the reason why i freaked out so much when i found out that there were spiders Ugh. I mean, they're, it's not that big of a deal because they're huge, like half the size of a VW Bug, but... Oh, shotgun, you can go back in here. We don't need you for a while. I am going to take the control room key, though, because we might need that. And I should probably take the combat knife, too. Yeah, I'm going to take the combat knife, too. Because I'm, I'm gonna drop off the the ink ribbons once I'm done with it, with saving. Oh my god, I get to save! I'm almost tempted to make this a short episode and be like, I can save, peace. Because <laughs> I, I I need to save. I think. Yeah, no. Killing that many enemies, that deserves a save. Definitely. Guardhouse. Oh, okay, that's where we are. No, I'm not going to call it an end of an episode. Um, so we got some exploring to do. Drop the ink ribbon, hold on to the command key. Let's go. Uh, 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 I'm not moving that statue. <laughs> I'm not moving that statue. <laughs> no matter how much you want me to. I keep expecting like something to jump out of the wall at me, or like, like the the hallway with the dogs, like them just crashing out at me. All right. Well, wait, wait, wait. Before we go in here, because we know there's bees in here. Like, they won't spawn for a while, I guess. Or until we start walking through the room, but... I want to check to see if that key fits this door. Maybe. It's locked. The plate says 002. No, okay. That's, that's okay. Alright, so let's run through this room. It's only bees. Chris can, Chris can handle that. Right? No, come on. <sighs> what is this? What is this? Will you take the dormitory key? Yes, I will. And I will get the hell out of Dodge, because, oh my god. Did you see the size of that hive? That's freaking me out now. Oh, oh, two. Okay. Run. Run. Is like the frickin' Tracker Jackers from uh, Hunger Games. For any of you that have seen that. Oh my god, that scene was amazing. Like, I'm really glad that they didn't make it as grotesque as they described it in the book. As they, um... But I was, I was very pleased with what I, what they did do, so. This key is useless now, discard. 
If someone was saying, how does Chris know how that it's useless? Well, this one makes sense, because, I mean, there's only going to be one room labeled 002. So. But no, I'm, I'm going to trust the game on this one, because, like I was saying, it's not like Simon's Quest. It's not trying to trick me. Okay, don't hear any footsteps. I'm going to check this door first, actually. Probably a bad idea, because we know we're in a deserted room, because of the lack of footsteps, but whatever. Yep, bad idea. Okay, waste a bullet. Great, 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 great. Whatever. <laughs> I can stand to waste one bullet, right? Oh, cool, he's dead. What is that? Oh! No water is left, but oh! Yeah, nothing special, it's just shit all over the ground. Ew, it's disgusting. The toilet bowl cracked open or something. Like, where even is the rest of the toilet bowl? Jeez, that's, that's, good. that's disgusting. Oh my god. I can hear a cat somewhere in my house. Meow, meow. <laughs> Unless that's in the game. Oh my god, zombie cats. Along with zombie dogs and zombie snakes and zombie spiders. Oh, hey, a map. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Hmm. Hmm, what is this? Suspicious looking, I say. Why? Well, we'll find out, won't we? Plant 42 report. Let's look at this first. Four days have passed since the accident, and the plant at point 42 is growing amazingly fast. It has been affected by the T-Virus differently than other plants have been, and shows unique shape in addition to its size. Looking at the way it behaves, it is now difficult to determine what kind of plant it was originally. There are two ways in which Plant 42 gathers nutrition. The first one is through its root that reaches into the basement. Immediately after the accident, a scientist went mad and broke the water tank in the, ba in the basement. Now the basement is filled with water. It is easily imaginable that some chemical elements were blended in the water and promotes the incredibly fast growth of Plant 42. Another part of Plant 42 from the basement grows through the duct and hangs down like so many bulbs from the ceiling of the first floor. Many vines come out of these those bulbs, and they are the second resource for its nutrition. Once sensing movement, Plant 42 shoots its vines around the prey and holds it. Then it starts sucking up blood, using the suckers located at the back of its vine. It also has some intelligence. It blocks the door by twining its vines around it's, uh, it, especially when it captures prey or sleeping. One second, this is actually hurting my jaw a little. Already, several staff members have, or no, several staff members have already fallen victim to this. May 21st, 1998. Henry Sarton. Oh, thank God they skipped my birthday. <laughs> this is three days after my birthday. Oh, it didn't happen when I was eight. Oh, didn't, didn't we already find that out, though? Plant 42 report has been filed, and my jaw has been knocked out of commission for the next day. <laughs> A dormitory sketch. Will you take it? Yes, I will. That'll actually be pretty helpful. Uh, please don't tell me this one's locked. The desk is locked. Of course it's locked. Why wouldn't it be locked? You see, there's some sort of switch here, is there? No. Well, can we move it? Yes, we can. Can we move it any farther? No. Well, boogers. What am I going to do now? Because I see that there's, like, a hole back there. But I cannot reach it. <gasps> oh! Oh, I see. Oh, now what? There's a ladder. Will you descend it? Oh, this is leading us into the basement with Plant 42, isn't it? Yeah, actually, I will. Sounds like a 
swell idea. Uh, kind of regretting it now. Because of the off kilter, like midi, midi, midi accordion music. Okay, no. Nothing down that way. <laughs> it's a naughty knee miner! Every, everyone knows that's a sailor's worst nightmare. I'm blocking up that vent. I'm guessing that's what that box is for. Because I don't want something like coming out of the woodworks for me. Of course, I can't see what this box is for. Uh, wait, wait. Okay, nothing down the hall. Oh, okay. So I'm guessing we have to push these crates down. No. Okay, I'm guessing we don't have to push these crates down. I was thinking, oh, maybe we push these crates it down. Water settles here and I can't pass it. I was thinking maybe we push the crates down and we pass over the crates. But no. Wait, what? Yeah, we do. Okay. For some reason, it, it didn't want to push for me. Okay, for a second I thought that triggered something. It, it almost sounded like panic music for a second. Okay, no footsteps. <laughs> I keep getting panicked by my own footsteps. That's the worst kind of panic. Because it happens every time I move. Alright, and we can walk across now, right? Right? No? What do we need? Do we really need the last box? This is gonna be a pain. So we gotta push this back this way. I don't like that grate down there. Something tells me, like, gas will flood in there if I do something wrong or something. Wait, is there something on top of the box? Okay, no, it just looks like it might have just been a graphical glitch or something. And push it that way, Chris. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, you got it, you got it. There we go, perfect. Oh man, I learned my box pushing skills from Pokemon. <laughs> I mean, who didn't as a kid, you know? Especially like going through... Oh, uh, going through Victory Road. And then all the times the later puzzles use those strength puzzles, or the later games use those strength rock puzzles. Oh look, it's a kosher box. <laughs> no, it just looks like a uh, Star of David. <laughs> I don't even know what it says though, I can't tell. That's really weird. I, you, I would have thought you could have just gone across on two. Okay. Just, you know, check in in case... Because if there was anything down the hallway, Chris would turn for it. That's water. Um, ooh, what's this? A green herb. Yes, I will take the green herb. Thank you very much. And what are you? What are you? Uh, I can't carry any more green herbs. Oh, well. Sorry, little buddy. Just have to wait back here. Okay, I thought that was another plant or something. Oh, it's getting deeper. This is the basement, isn't it? Ooh, I don't like this. I do not like this at all. We're gonna be... It's gonna be plant 42, isn't it? 